What is up guys? Welcome back to part three of the Shaving the Bay of the Mark Three. <laughs> part three of the Mark Three. <laughs> if you can see right here, I had my grinder out and I was uh, just trying to grind away at some of that plastic or I called it plastic of some of that glue uh, that was right there. I managed to get some of it away. I'm gonna take the the saw right now and see if I can't pick some of it back. So I got a lot of it off. Uh, I might can take my grinder and get the rest of that off. That's um, that's picking out of there. Like again, I don't think I have the patience to sit here and just trim all that. The guys that do sit here and trim all this off that make that crap look super perfect, man, heads up to you guys. You don't really know what it takes unless you do this crap to make these things really look good. Alright guys, so I'll be out here grinding. It is pitch black out here nighttime and I pretty much can't see anything now. So I guess I'm gonna be done for tonight, but I did get majority of all that out there sanded down and got the side sanded down with a lot of the I'll show you guys this in the morning. How about that? Alright, so it's the next morning and <clears throat> this is what I was trying to say last night that I got uh, a lot of that sanded down and I got a lot of that uh sealing stuff out of there and I did get the back wall back there down too and a lot of that side um that's that's what I'm good for right there the rest of that I'm about to try to sand it down handily and what I got is what I got I just still need to take that off of there and so I need to sand up uh, I sanded the hides down and I got some more degreasers so I can get back there and clean all the rest of that off of there too so that is kind of today's plan and I need to run back to AutoZone so I can get some um, some of the rust stuff so that way this right here doesn't start to rust on me because it does rain a lot so yeah don't know how it's supposed to be but I can feel you turn me around if love can go sideways look back at me and I won't let you down I went and got some of these uh, plastic cloth. Um, also got uh, some more blue tape. And um, oh, I got some of this uh, rust barrier stuff. I didn't know how long it was going to be, so I actually put some paint on it. So I got some rust barrier and um, some sandable primer. All of this is like supposed to help keep the rust away. So I have like rust stuff in it. So. Um, yeah, I got a couple cans of those. Probably going to grab some more cans of primer. Um, but that's to start me off and to see where I'm going to, you know, end up at. And I also got some cloths. So I guess I'll go ahead with start with this fender and just wrap it up. That way no paint or nothing gets on it. And I'll just start there. There we have it. It is uh, primer out now. Oh, the primer is on.
I don't think it looks too bad. I might go get another can of primer and just to hit it one more time. Um, but yeah, I think so. I think it looks good now. I could just go ahead and lay the paint on top of this and be perfectly fine. Now, I was sitting here having a conversation and with my girl and it was like, I mean, I guess I could take my time, right? I, I could just take my time, right? And cover up these holes. See how these holes are like this? But to be completely 100, I kind of don't want to. I kind of like the way the holes are. It keeps like the originality of the bay. Maybe like when I get the next car, like my next Volkswagen, which hopefully will be a Corrado, um, I will do that. I might, you know, go ahead and cover the holes up and just give it that one complete look like that right there just one complete look but i don't know that's this is this is what i'm feeling right now i don't know, each car i did i took it a little bit further than i did before and you know i appreciate the way it comes out you can see that i'm not perfect in anything that i do i was even looking at it right here i mean even with my cuttings i cut that back but like the cuttings are it's not perfect but if you could tell that I did it, somebody that wasn't perfect. <laughs> and I don't mind that, I like it. So yeah, drop a comment down below and let me know what you think. I did get the primer on it, I did get it sanded down and covered up. So um, I guess I'll catch you guys in the next video where we start to paint this thing. So yeah, I guess I will catch you guys in the next video. Remember guys, have an awesome day.